Be safe, some snacks for the dog sitters. I haven't eaten all the snacks. I can save some for you. I've been really good, actually. I've been trying to eat less. It's been... I haven't relapsed with Taco Bell. It's been... Mm, I think over two weeks now. It's been over two weeks since I last had Taco Bell. <laughs> Aren't you guys proud of me? Mm, I I was I almost uh, ordered it when we were watching SummerSlam, but I didn't. I didn't give them. <laughs> and I've been I've been eating pretty decent. I mean, uh, for my uh, for my point of view. <laughs> mm -mm. But, Ba, 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 ba. She doesn't need to say snack. She is the snack. Oh, that is a good idea. Can I use that as an excuse to just eat everything in the pantry now? <laughs> yeah, I can't believe they won't let us jab and geek out about WWE and UFC. <clears throat> well, I guess talking about it is fine. <coughs> Um, <laughs> my bad. <laughs> I, I, I wish I could have warned you about that, but it just kind of came out. <laughs> my bad. Um, <laughs> as I was saying, I guess we can talk about it, but we just can't show any clips at all. Even if they're edited, highlight reels out of context yesterday i never showed any complete match i kept pausing the videos i kept forwarding we were watching highlight reels and i still got the video taken down <laughs> so i just can't show any clips it seems even if they're like heavily edited and paused and commentated over, over. <clears throat> <laughs> Hi, Coco, good morning. <laughs> Quick hope but reasonable, eat a few snacks and so for another day. <laughs> Sometimes she can't help, but it's like, even if we watch like 30 second highlights, they don't like it. Yup. Because that's what we were watching yesterday. We were on the website looking at highlight clips. They were not even the, the full matches. And even though they were edited highlight clips, wait, what? Sorry, I pinned that on accident. <laughs> even though they were highlight clips, they still took them. <clears throat> but whatever, I guess I can just show still images from now on. <laughs> if I want you guys to look at something, I don't. Uh, hold on. I don't remember if we actually finished looking through that WWE starts with that beard strap. <laughs> we were japping so much that I forgot. I, I forgot we were looking at them. <laughs> you guys wanna finish it? I still need to pack. <laughs> I still need to pack a hit. <laughs> I think we got the Randy Orton. I don't remember. <laughs> We saw Triple H. I have a social experiment I wanna try, so obviously when we give the balls, get thrown. But if multiple people gift, will more balls get thrown? I think so. Wow! Balls! I think so. I added one for like follows, uh, but I, the other ones are auto... Uh, auto set up. So I actually don't know. <laughs> Under cage call. Hi, I'm cool. I should bring shiny items. Oh, shiny. I'll get distracted easily. Mm. I'm not like some easy breezy. <laughs> well, well, well. Mm. 
I hope you're having a decent day at work. Wait, who is this? Scott Steiner. You can't even compare this picture because he's much older in the second picture. What the fuck? Big Shell! Oh, I don't think Big Shell looks much different without beard. But I think I'm just really used to seeing him. Like his face overall. I can't really confuse him for another guy. It's the Big Shell! Big ho! <laughs> Let's see, it just popped off. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, I wanted to make some tea first. So, I thought I could just use my coffee machine to heat up water. Coffee machine is making me so lazy. Wait, why is there so much water here? <coughs> Hold on, chat. <laughs> Still sounds like a faulty vibrator. <laughs> but hey, I don't have to go downstairs and turn on the stove. So that's pretty great. It's all in all, it's still a good trade off. In my opinion. <laughs> it just takes a bit to heat up sometimes. Uh, but hey, in the meantime, let's pack a hit. I've been having, ever since I got the machine, I've been having coffee every morning. So today, I swear I'm only using it to heat up water and make some ginger tea. Here. room for the tea bag. Yay! 
I guess. side right now. <laughs> Don't burn yourself. Too late. I burned the tip of my tongue when I first tried to <laughs> sip a little bit to make room for the tea bag. <laughs> But it wasn't that bad. It wasn't that bad. Nyanya. <clears throat> Should actually go to sleep. Pussy night of my real good night, salty. Sweet dreams. Love you. Bye bye. We're going to go ahead. I already have the salsa grinded. So we're gonna skip that step today. Things is strong enough to lift me up. I'm not that small. 
maybe. <laughs> blame it on the dog. Exactly. You don't blame it on the dog. <laughs> Stop analyzing my farting body language. <laughs> You guys are dogs. <laughs> okay, now let's actually smoke some gas and stairs instead of passing gas. <laughs> Cheers. I'm just trying not to cough in your face. <clears throat> I still got a little smoke. Letting gas out both ways. <laughs> Help! <clears throat> Random question. Uh, um, does leftover smoke come out of your lungs after you burp? Um, no, it's never happened. I think it's because I don't really keep smoking, I just like inhale and exhale. Maybe that's why, or I don't know, but I don't, I've never really experienced that. <laughs> Would it be funny? <clears throat> like Shrek said, better out than in. <laughs> Supposed to be a princess. Mm. A stinky dog princess. <laughs> you know what? Maybe Gus is fine. 
I am just a dog after all. <clears throat> I want to see John or then John versus Punk or John versus Roman before he goes. Oh, those sound like really good matches, but I feel like that's not gonna happen. I feel like I feel it because <clears throat> because these characters are kind of faces or becoming faces. I don't know, like what is Randy Orton currently? Because once I started getting back into WWE, I noticed he he had gotten so much nicer. He like even interacts with the crowd now. He didn't used to do any of that shit. <clears throat> um, but now he's like helping out Cody Rhodes and doing all these other things. CM Punk, I've always seen seen him as a face. And I think Roman, they're, they're trying to switch it. <clears throat> I think he might be turning over to face <clears throat> because he's so popular that I don't think that he could remain a heel <clears throat> for too long um, and because John Cena, you know, is also a face I think matching him up against any of those guys um, just would be difficult I guess, like it doesn't make sense but who knows, I would love to see it too <clears throat> that's for sure Either he was just performing, now he's doing actual crowd work. Yeah. Uh, and the fact that he's even helping Cody is like very out of character of him, in my opinion. <laughs> so, I we all are just kind of anticipating and predicting that he's going to betray Cody. We just don't know when. <clears throat> he didn't get much of a pop after the entrance. I still think he should have won. Or Hollywood. I like John Cena as an actor and uh, <clears throat> athlete. <clears throat> Did you guys, um, did you guys watch Ricky Stanicky? We watched it, um, we watched it in the server, but I just don't remember who was exactly there. <clears throat> but I think that was a funny movie, I think it was good. <clears throat> Have you done big face, do face matches before? Oh yeah, I mean... Yeah, you're right. <laughs> it's not like it's an impossible... <clears throat> possible thing to arrange, I guess. Randy is not gonna betray Cody. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure he's not. <clears throat> That's what I wanna believe. <clears throat> is Randy actually finally a face character? Did you know how he met his wife? I think, I don't know if I read it here with you guys or another time but she was, he literally picked up a mouth from the crowd <laughs> This lady went to a WWE show with her two sons and one of them made a sign that said Randy Orton RKO my mom please <laughs> and they caught Randy's eye like he actually stopped to read it and then he liked what he saw quote unquote and approached uh, the mom and got her number And that's how Randy Orton met his current wife. It's just really funny. Like, 
the simplest thing. Just her going to a show with her two kids. <laughs> I think... <clears throat> um, I think now even they have their own kids, but I'm not sure. John Cena was in Scooby-Doo. Oh yes! Yes he was! I forgot! <laughs> They had the random, more, most random collaborations in Scooby Doo series. Um, who else did <laughs> they? They did a. Have they done Scooby Doo and Batman? I feel like they have. They they done Scooby Doo and the Teenage Mutant Turtles. <clears throat> It would be kinda dumb if they haven't done Scooby Doo and Batman. I mean they both solve mysteries. Yep, okay. <clears throat> I can't remember if I saw it. I've seen so much Batman media. But I, I just don't I don't remember. And they actually it looks like they had two films together. Yes they did. They had <laughs> Hi Molly. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? I hope you had a good weekend. Mm -hmm. They had two movies. They had Scooby Doo meets Batman <laughs> and Scooby Doo Batman the Brave and Bold. <laughs> well, I can Good morning. <clears throat> I hope we're all starting the week off decently, and if not, just remember that it's Monday, and tomorrow it'll be Tuesday. <laughs> I know everyone knows that, but sometimes you just need to hear it. <clears throat> Working? Yeah, that's what I figured. Have a good day at work, Molly. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> My week started with beats was up to the test next flight. <laughs> Same for me. <clears throat> I love starting off the mornings with you guys. They give me such a kick for the day. And I remember to do my... Um, morning routine stuff actually like eat something <clears throat> something with protein that will sustain me for the day or brushing my teeth stretching speaking of stretching <clears throat> oh, <yeah. clears throat> This is really random, but uh, I've successfully <clears throat> turned everyone in my household and most of our friends that come visit. <clears throat> I have successfully turned them over to House of the Dragon. <laughs> so now, every person that I've interacted with IRL. Every time they see me, they ask me about House of the Dragon. <laughs> <laughs> My plan is working out. <laughs> I went to pick up... Because um, we're all really chill. Um, I went to pick up my roommate yesterday. <clears throat> at her job. And... <laughs> And all of her co-workers come to hang out and chill with us at our place from time to time. So we're all very cool. And I went to pick them up and I was chatting with them. <laughs> One of them was like, oh I can't be around you guys because I'm not caught up to House of Dragon yet. And honestly I've never really even talked to this person so that means that they 
the people that I've been influencing have been influencing other people. The chain? Well, <laughs> my bad. The chain is growing. Soon, everyone that works at that store is gonna be talking about House of Dragon. <laughs> I'm not a girl. I'm a dog. I'm a dog. Sometimes 
to just wake up my Nan sometimes to wake up the eye my fluffy while well, the warm tea makes me feel so cozy. I just wanna go back to bed now. Waking up going then depressed. Um, you think it will give me water again if I just ask nicely? <laughs> okay, okay. I'm gonna do a spank with him now. So make sure you guys are listening because I'm not gonna do it again. I'm too cozy to pull my pants down again. It's actually really cold in this apartment in the morning because we forgot to turn off the AC last night. And the house is fucking freezing now. I think it's like 80 degrees outside though. Um, actually, maybe it should be a little more warm. Bumpers on your horns. <laughs> when I said brain protection, that's not what I meant. <laughs> but you know what? I can't. I can't blame you. <clears throat> Besides, it's not like. Well, is it actually working? It kind of sounds like it's brewing up a storm. <laughs> it's not like Jack could get me pregnant. <clears throat> I am part dong after all. I mean, you guys can try. We could definitely give it a try for science. <clears throat> Fill the cup. <sighs> okay, it might. <sighs> Yay! We have boiling water again. And my tea. <laughs> I 
I got that dog in me. <laughs> you guys got that dog on you? Okay, cha. Prove it. Back for me. You got that dog in you? Let me see your best bike right now. <laughs> well, not with that. I don't just mean I have to try hard. Nice try. <laughs> what do you mean, nice try? Because there's a one saying you have the dog in you. <clears throat> I just wanted to speak dog with my fellow dog sitters. <laughs> This isn't biodegradable, so we should just sit for the environment, right? <laughs> now you're thinking. Chat really has their thinking hat on today. <laughs> look, 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 look. <clears throat> hold on, hold on. <clears throat> I'm, I'm gonna try to. <clears throat> Okay, okay, here comes my scariest bike. Are you ready? Look! Wait, wait, wait. wait. Uh, has to, there has to be some ground to it. <laughs> so people know I mean business. Like, rap! <laughs> so I'm just gonna say it like my little baby cousin. Pow wow! Pow wow. Pow wow. <laughs> wow wow. I like I like saying it. Wow wow. Wow wow. Wow wow. Wow wow. Because mm, uh, I I don't I don't know where I got this from but like I people in my family used to like instead of like I didn't even know why this is an expression, but like people in my family used to be like, <laughs> El perrito dice wow wow. <laughs> el perrito, el perrito, el perrito dice wow wow. El perrito dice wow wow. Wow wow. Wow wow. Wow wow. Okay, cool. So, I'm just taking that. <laughs> wow wow. Wow wow. Wow wow. <laughs> Clara, Clara, thank you for the follow. Mm -hmm. Welcome. I just shitted and farted, don't do that again. <laughs> that be in me. <clears throat> oh. I mean, not right now, but if you want some bee in you. <laughs> we could make that happen. Mm. There was one time where. I was I was trying to raise up this cute girl and she said she was like I think she said she was like Vietnamese and Mexican and then I I asked her if she would like some more Mexican in her <laughs> like this was like I want to say like three years ago, maybe more. No, actually, it was like five years ago. Yeah, it was five years ago. <laughs> I, I cringe, but it actually worked. Like she, she, <laughs> she started laughing and flirting back. <clears throat> Kiss and joy for twenty. Welcome. He's much. <laughs> Tie the knot? No. Take the knot. Yes. <laughs> that should be my life motto. Wait. Dad, I pulled my pants down and then I just started chilling here. I'm too comfortable around you guys. Also, the ADHD just kinda kicked in, I guess, so I forgot what I was doing. But, uh, I still have to catch up to the redeems. <laughs> so. Oh no, that's the end of the pictures without beard gallery. 
<coughs> we ended up. Oh, come on. We we ended with this fucker. Who who even is this? I don't really recognize him. <coughs> who this? This is the last person on the thing. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna do it now so I can pull my pants up. Cause it's cold. It's cold huh? <laughs> you listening? Okay, ready? <laughs> what? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. <laughs> okay. That was a good slap. The second one had a lot like poise to it. But I don't think it sound it like echoed as much because of the angle. <clears throat> Yeah, a room so that's in AEW. Wait, what? You guys just gave me two different names. <laughs> <laughs> Who's drawing here? Well, I don't, I don't really know him. <clears throat> John, John Maxi, John Maxi. <clears throat> they look like him. No. <clears throat> oh, it's both. Oh. Oh, oh, I see that. He just went by <clears throat> different names. He went from Moxley Mox. Moxley Mox. <laughs> Moxley Mox. Jonathan Moxley. John Moxley. And Dean Ambrose. Oh, you. Yeah, oh, okay. He's just one of those guys with a bunch of aliases, huh? <laughs> that makes sense. Mm. Yeah, I got some jiggle feedback. And I still haven't put my pants on. Okay, I'm gonna do it now. Mm, honestly. <laughs> yeah, but it's okay. We do a little bit of joking and drawing around sometimes. Wow, hello. Well, table tat. I'll see you. Versus Roman versus Seth. <laughs> I haven't seen him fight or not well I'm pretty sure I've seen him around but I just can't I can't really remember any matches or anything and so I would say I don't really know him <clears throat> I can't wait for Monday night tonight I'm excited to see all the drama. <laughs> I can't believe, I still can't believe Dom picked Liv over Rhea. I, that gave me such whiplash. He played the card so well. I just complete. it's WWE, like the storylines can be so predictable sometimes. But... I really thought that he was playing dumb this time, and he needed to actually stay with Rhea. People are saying that it might be also like, because there has been, uh, <clears throat> there has been competition between, there's like clips of Rhea versus Dom out there I think, and I have no idea. <clears throat> Like what? When were they ever fighting? Oh no. I shouldn't have done that. Let's do it here. <laughs> oh, slow morning, I see. <clears throat> One year ago. Three weeks 
ますが。There's not much, actually. Like, what is this? <laughs> Dean said the Roman were an attack team named the Shield V. Yeah. Oh, wait, that, wait. Dean. Oh, that's him. He's the third member of the Shield. Whoops. Yeah, I wasn't there for the Shield era, although I do n know about them. I just forget Dean also because we don't really know him like that. <laughs> the, he, since he wasn't active. And I think I jumped back literally when he left. I don't know if I'm gonna watch it, but I'll figure it out. Yeah, point time. I'll I'll start I'll start taking that here. Thank you. Blank blank one. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. Welcome. What the fuck? This is not what I was looking for. <laughs> Why is this so long? <clears throat> They're just showing Ray Mysterio injured right now. But look, there's... There's clips of them competing. I wasn't here for this era. Like, I have no idea what's going on here. I missed all of this. Mm -hmm. People are saying that it's because Dom still has a grudge against Rhea for the, all the times that she kicked his ass in front of people. People were saying that about why it makes sense that he left with Liv. But I don't... I don't think this even has anything to do with any of that. It's just Dom being a dumbass and wanting to piss everyone off. Mm. Good morning, the man Smith. The man, God just called you the man. Dean, the guy who always wrestled in Gene. <laughs> Dean left because of Vince. Oh. Mm. Yeah. I definitely wasn't around for the shield area. I don't know if it was any god around that time. <clears throat> or maybe he's just tired of submissives. <laughs> he wanted to just switch it up. <clears throat> That's another running theory. <clears throat> maybe it really was the chicken nuggets, you guys. Who are we to... Assume that Dominic is sex driven. Maybe he's chicken nugget driven. <laughs> he's mysterious. <laughs> Look at his shirt. <laughs> what? He used to actually rock shit with Dom? Los Mysterios. I love his shirt. It's so funny. <laughs> Look. Actually wearing Marriage of him and Dom. See, I missed all of this shit. <clears throat> this is 2022. Yeah, I got, I got back into WWE last year. So I missed everything that happened here. Mm -hmm. he, he chicken bugging. <laughs> she wouldn't buy him chicken nuggets. I understand Dominic if that's the reason. Mm, because, you know, to keep someone happy, not only do you have to give them lots of attention and love, but you should be able to also fill their belly with food. <laughs> I know where your mind is going, chat. Mm. Has Selena Baga went back with Andrade? Um, 
I don't think so. Oh, and this is when Jay was with Jimmy as well. And some people say they're really hard to tell apart, but I think, I think Jimmy just has that like more natural evil menace face to him. Like you could just tell them apart <laughs> because one of them looks like he's going to drop kick you at any moment. <laughs> that was crazy. Especially because you know what threw me off? It's when like when Rhea and Dom reconciled and you know he like told L uh Liv off in front of everyone and Liv wasn't even butthurt enough to fake cry. That night, I was like, oh, okay, I guess the Liv arc is just like, it's done. Her Rhea is back with Dove, and everything is fine. So, seeing Dom do that at SummerSlam really just, <laughs> it, it gave me whiplash. <clears throat> What else were you feeling with, puppy? <laughs> what were you feeling? <laughs> if I speak... <laughs> I will not. <clears throat> because I'm being a good girl. And... early to be this horny. I saw Rhea fan taking a pic with Dom and telling her he was Team Rhea all the way. <laughs> what? And <laughs> telling him to be Rhea all the way. He's such a snake. Oh yeah, this was the moment here, here. I'm back. Are they gonna TMCM me because of this? It's only a moment. <laughs> good girls get filled though. Yeah, good girls need feelings too. What? Look! <laughs> He's like, you don't need that. You got this queen. Just finish her off the old fashioned way. The real way. You got this. And she's like, okay, yeah. Bad, whatever. <laughs> as soon as this happened, I knew where things were going. If you read Dom's post before SummerSlam, it's hinted that he's tired of being mommy's little bitch. I don't, I didn't read his post before SummerSlam. I don't follow Dom on Twitter, you know what, maybe I should because I kind of want to keep tabs on the little shithead. <laughs> where is he? Where are you, Dom? There he is. Wait, it's... this is not him, is it? Yeah, no, wait, this is him. Why doesn't he have a... uh... Why doesn't he have a check mark, like... He's verified. He should be verified. <laughs> because... What the heck is this? I almost thought I was... Looking at our roleplay account at first. <clears throat> but hey, let's follow him because I wanna keep tabs on this fucker. Four minutes ago, when I wake up in the morning, I piss excellence. <laughs> 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 the 
the real story? It is maybe the real reason why all of this went down <laughs> is truly because Ria's husband was tired of seeing this Mexican short king kiss kiss up on his wife every week. <laughs> I had to change it up. <laughs> I woke up in a good mood. This was was this summer slam, yeah. Oh no, it was after summer slam. <laughs> she gets me, thank you. Wait, okay, let me see what he posted before summer slam. So cute though. <laughs> the purple really fits them. <laughs> oh, this drama arc is really funny. Speaking of Rhea's husband, he's in AEW? He was asking Tony Khan to get involved? No way! <laughs> Donald's cooked for years, is that what you're saying? <laughs> yeah, but he plays the role really well. Mm, give him some credit. <laughs> but honestly, if you got the chance to be cooked by Rhea Ripley... I mean, chat. <laughs> I'm no better than some men. <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> I'm doing the fuckboy thing. <laughs> I need that as a toggle now. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> Hi, Labby. Good morning. <laughs> it's so embarrassing when... <clears throat> Um, don't <laughs> saying it this way makes me sound really edgy and unwell, but you know, be knowing that I'm being perceived by um, more sane women. <laughs> women that are more sane than me sometimes it gives me a little bit of like performance society <laughs> <laughs> you know I don't want to fully scare the bitches away it just happens I'm doing my best to get in there <laughs> holding low cup <laughs> not correctly What's up, girl? <laughs> You're giving me Twitter PTSD. Uh, I... It, it's... I always get like one or three people that are like, oh, so... Be single, huh? And then I think they tip their hat or fedora and then they're like, What's up, girl? Do you wanna date? I want to know everything about you all of a sudden and I'm so interested in getting to know all of your interests too and that shit pisses me off so much <laughs> especially when like I guess this is kinda like it's similar not specifically me announcing that I'm single or anything but um, what was that post that I made? Uh, I said, if I ever tweet about my boyfriend or girlfriends, I'm talking about my dog sitters. I'm too needy and clingy for most people, but the dog sitters don't mind and it's a team effort. <laughs> and then people took that as a way of like, me announcing that I'm single and ready to mingle. 
when it's like quite the opposite of that why would a stranger or someone that I barely interact with try to shoot their shot and risk me up and be like <clears throat> my lady so you're single I've heard you're single so there's a chance huh so I have a shot and like no dude you're way at the bottom of the list you're not even a dog sitter like sit the fuck down <laughs> shit pissed me off <clears throat> and I think the best approach to it is when someone's like oh I'm interested in becoming a dog sitter or like how do you like could you explain that to me like that shows more of like actual interest in like trying to jump ahead of the line and rush things like I don't even know you <laughs> I like this is like the second time you've interacted with me on Twitter like, how am I supposed to care about you or like take you seriously or you're like you know what I mean mm, it's a Twitter so you're saying there's a chance this is a polycule between B and the toxiters <laughs> Yeah, that's right. You have to compete with my dog sitters in order to wow me or uh, he want to even stand the chance of being my partner, but that's really hard to do because, like I mentioned before, <laughs> I'm just really clingy and I think I could be a little bit too much for one person, especially if it's in a long distance scenario. Um, granted, I am a little less crazy when my partner is actually physically able to uh, be around me, but when it comes to long distance relationships, I am not the most pleasant person to be with because I need to know where you are 24-7 where my brain is going to assume bad things and I just drive myself crazy doing those type of things <laughs> so when people say especially people that don't really know me personally like some of the dog sitters when they say it's okay that I'm clingy and that they they want to shoot their shot or try to risk me up. I'm just like, I don't think you know what you're getting yourself into. <laughs> I don't think you know me at all, especially people that like uh, don't have a lot of dating experience. I don't, I don't think you'll want to jump into, uh, you know, start dating people online. It's better to just try to. You know, especially if you if you've never had uh, re like a serious relationship with someone, I I actually do recommend that you seek that out before you try to have multiple like you know relationships online because online relationships are very different, at least in my opinion. And then like having someone that you can go out with and see and cuddle and you know physically touch mm. but um yeah obviously some people have never even gone on a date in person and that's fine but I do I do think they're two very different things mm. and because I have anxiety and ADHD and a bunch of other things that I don't want to sit down and list and talk about right now it can be very hard for me to be mentally at peace with someone uh, that's, you know not with me <laughs> long distance relationship <laughs> which well, uh, uh, 
Which I have no problem. Um, which I have no problem, like, being... I mean, if I'm being honest, yeah, I still do, like, I still stalk some of my dog sitters. But, like, in a healthy way. <laughs> In a good way, just like, you know, sometimes a quick look, or like, if I'm wondering how this person is doing, I might go on their Twitter one day and like, see if they're having a good or bad day. I don't know. I... Mm, uh, I can be a really parasocial weirdo, I guess, but... You do have to interact with me, and I have to know you for me to like... Uh... Even do any of those things. I don't do that for everyone. <laughs> I swear. I'm not I'm not a weird stalker or anything. <laughs> I tried a long distance relationship for about a year. It can be rough. Yeah. I've tried several long distance relationships and I'm not like I'm not <laughs> hey maybe I really am the problem because I'm the common factor, right? But I've never had a successful long distance relationship. <laughs> full honesty, full transparency, mask off moment. I I've never had a successful online relationship, even with people that I've like gotten to meet in person and like physically hang out with I've it 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 just they're really hard <laughs> for both individuals but I'm really clingy so mm, not not really something I wanna do in the future. Mm. <laughs> You have my permission to stalk me. <laughs> Yay! <coughs> Cha. If I can stalk you, type one. <coughs> I just wanna see who's willing to let me stalk to their social media. <laughs> <laughs> Once in chat, if I can stalk you, please, 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 please. Oh, no, no, no. I want to know which one of you is actually okay with a dog girl looking through your stuff from time to time. <laughs> that changes today. <laughs> Twitter be like, <clears throat> yay! Well, I could stalk some of my favorite dog sitters. <clears throat> it's okay. It's not like I needed you guys to type one or anything. I was already stalking you guys. <laughs> but like, again, in, in, in like a moderate, moderate uh, manner. <clears throat> I don't do it very often. <laughs> but, you know, I look curious. Well, especially on the days where, like, I don't, I don't stream at all. And I'm just like, man, I miss the dog seaters. I wonder what they're up to. And I'll just, mm, I'll just take a moment and... <laughs> <laughs> okay, besides that. <laughs> Take a moment to check it. <laughs> that one just came out. Sorry, I couldn't worry about that. <clears throat> I suck these bait Twitter page all the time too. <laughs> <laughs> Got a chicken. I do that with you. <laughs> I'm glad I'm not the only parasocial weirdo. <laughs> Yay! <clears throat> and they remove likes? 
I still do it though. I hate that they removed likes. I'm so pissed that they did that. <laughs> but oh well, I think the fact that they removed likes also um, probably is like nature is healing for some people. <laughs> Especially me, because now I don't get to see... Unless, like, people are, like, actively interacting and commenting under it. Now I don't get to see when other people like pictures of other girls or puppies. Now I'm just blissfully ignorant. It's good to be here. Mm. They better not roll that update back. Because if they do, I am gonna hate it. I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you for the, thank you, thank you, thank you for the water tea. It's a good reminder. I think my tea is pretty cold now. chaser and all of his likes are full of trans porn like just you know mm, tea girls and untucked mm, untucked beautiful pinnacles everywhere <laughs> I bet that's what Elon's likes are full of. Because the way he tweets, he'd just be glazing. The, I, there's no way that someone with that much money and responsibility is like always so anti everything on Twitter. Like it's such, such a hater. There's no way, you know? Like, he must be deflecting at this point, like, um, he posts, like, some bullshit, uh, stories that, like, his daughter has debunked as well, just to, like, get people riled up, like, get him in the anti-trans bandwagon. I don't, like, I'm, I'm sure that's like his favorite category of porn at this point. That's usually how it goes. Mm, every person, I remember, <laughs> I remember working for this, uh, this trading company in New York, and the, the CEO, I wasn't hired by him, so I didn't really see any red flags in the interviewing process. But then when I met the CEO, he was so fucking racist <laughs> that I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> and I just like, uh, the pay was really fucking good. And I stayed in that, working for that company for almost a year because one, the pay was really good and two, I didn't have to interact with the CEO much anyway because he was always in his office 
and I was in the accounting department <clears throat> so I only really got to see him like twice a week sometimes three times if he really needed something but um, he was racist and old as fuck and one time he was out of the office and he called me to look for something in his office oh on his computer right and <laughs> his computer was full of so much black and latina girl porn i was like oh my god there's barely any white girl porn here this racist old motherfucker is like this is his favorite category <laughs> And now I just assume that anyone that's like super hateful towards a certain specific group I, I just assume that that's like their favorite category of porn Like they're deflecting or like closeted or I don't know but <laughs> That should give me whiplash I was like what the fuck <clears throat> I, I like his cars though I miss it with Elon Musk was just ships and cars now he's just like everyone else on fucking twitter he's a fucking dumbass did you guys see the new uh uh when diesel video you like his cars have you seen the cyber truck i saw what well, i think i don't know if i told you guys i saw cyber truck irl driving to my streets uh what was it like two days ago? And that shit looks so out of place, especially because he was driving through my neighborhood. I thought we were getting invaded. I <laughs> it looks like I don't know. It looks ugly. That shit looks ass. And I don't know if you guys have seen the the diesel whistling diesel video, but. Not only does the cyber truck looks kinda ass, but it's literally made out of plastic. I mean, the doors... And... From what it looks like, the actual body of the car, the cyber truck itself, is pretty durable and can withstand some impact, but everything else in the car is shit and it's going to break. He tested this out with a F-150 I think truck I think yeah <clears throat> hold on I just I just wanna get to it so he has both of the of the cars go through the same exact things and this is a really cool video if you guys haven't watched it I highly recommend it he definitely takes it the durability tests to the extreme and even goes so far as to put C4 explosive on the doors all the Mexican Latina I work with say the truck features are cool but the look is awful yeah yes 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 it should be just more like aesthetically pleasing on the eye it should be nicer looking especially for the money that you're paying this morning and i couldn't help but say it's the car from fortnite <laughs> them bucks elon likes femme cowboys definitely he does you know he does <laughs> Um, what I think is it's like the most concerning part about these drugs is just seeing how much plastic is surrounding them. <clears throat> They're driving a uh, off road, and it stops. The thing that started off with the truck already failing is that they got it they got it here 
and then they have to charge it. And not only did they have to wait around and charge it, but they have to use an app for the first time. And so he spends half of the day pretty much being on the phone with Tesla <clears throat> and trying to get this car charged. <clears throat> So, this would be already enough to piss me off. If I'm paying for a car, I don't want to spend hours trying to set it up. Like, I know it's part computer too, but holy shit, that would make me so impatient. I would just want to drive it. And this is just the beginning of it. He spends way more time doing that, actually. At the end of the entire thing, he says that he spent pretty much like half of the day... Half of the day charging the car and being on the phone with them. <clears throat> and then he also paid 10k for a feature that's not even available. So people are getting these trucks with incomplete features so they're not even done they're in beta stages and they're selling them out <clears throat> so many of them also had to be recalled already like the first couple of batches because we're seeing them now more because they're finally meeting the demand and manufacturing more but they already had recall incidents and not all of the features are available, even if you did pay for them in advance. Because, like she showed us here, this is a feature that you had to pay prior to ordering your Cybertruck. And he still can't use it, that's 10k for a feature that is not even available yet. Hi Gina, good morning. Good morning. Hi Nivis. Morning. We're just having some tea and chapping. I saw a cyber truck in my neighborhood recently. <laughs> and it reminded me of this video, which has been going viral ever since it was released because the cyber truck is just not built very well i mean it can resist some hits and damage but it can't really do a lot of things that a normal one you know f-150 can do <clears throat> basically it's a good car it's a good car if you are if you want to feel really safe in it, if you want to withstand hits, but if you want, you know, functionality and reliability, then you probably just need a classic pickup truck because this can't do a lot of the basic pickup truck things. Uh, and he goes really in depth with all of the durability tests everything that the Cybertruck goes through the F-150 does as well <clears throat> this test uh, the Cybertruck kind of one because it felt a lot smoother going up <clears throat> And it actually goes for an electric car as soon as, if it's fully charged and you hit the, <laughs> not gas, but the acceleration, it's gonna fucking go. I'll give it that, that looked pretty cool. Well, oh. Mm, but as soon as he starts like actually bumping the car, 
and trying to use it like a pickup truck, that's when the entire cyber truck is gonna start falling apart. Well, burp warning, I'm gonna burp. <laughs> well, really loud. <laughs> it's okay, you guys don't mind, do you? Oh no, I have two ends of my wig. <laughs> Where did I mess up? Oh well. Well. <laughs> Oh yeah, the truck got stuck here, and this is when they used the cyber truck to pull it. But look, the fucking bumper just comes off. So easy. All he did was pull the fucking F-150. You don't see any pickup truck do this shit. Like, their frame- look at this, it's being held by plastic. Look, look at how it's built. You could not hitch anything on this fucking cyber truck. If you can't pull the truck out of something like that, just... <laughs> it's made so badly. There's nothing that it can like... Because it's not built into the body, so of course when you put a lot of weight and force in it, it's just gonna snap. I don't know who thought this was a good idea. And you see it, and everything just looks like it's made out of cheap plastic. It's supposed to be able to tow 11k pounds. I don't think so. I <laughs> the cyber tracking for <laughs> I haven't played Fortnite in so long. <laughs> How many car updates have they had since? Probably so many. I love driving there though. <laughs> I should play again. You know what I really want to play, Cha? This is really lame. <laughs> and very, uh, very streamer bandwagon of me. But I've been seeing so many people play dress to impress on Roblox. <laughs> it looks so funny. The concept of like hosting a fashion show and having Cha rate the outfits is so funny. I would love to play that game but I I have not used Roblox in forever. I don't even think I have an account anymore. And I don't know, I I don't I don't know. <laughs> I'm always nervous about starting a uh, new game, especially games where like I have to interact with people online. And Roblox has some like a huge uh audience that, you know, is full of kids, young teenagers, so I've just stayed away from that game because that's not an audience that I want to be perceived by. <laughs> but uh, I I want to play the game. I want to play with you guys. Or I just want to like experience it. Because <laughs> it seems fun. <laughs> I just don't want to attract any... Any kids. Blah. Mm. Uh, what is this? Oh. Energy drink sponsor. Mm. Back to trucking. Mm, yeah. Cha. Mm. <laughs> mm. Come here, come here, come here. Yeah, my lips feel so dry because of the cotton mouth. Yeah. 
hold on, hold on. <laughs> okay. I'm wet. I'm gonna slobber you with puppy kisses now. Mm. really holding on to that <clears throat> I'm telling you I'm really gassy today I don't know why <laughs> I, bet, I don't even remember what I oh maybe too much protein last night before going to bed I was like I'm really hungry and I went out and got fried chicken. <laughs> I got fried chicken with my roommates and it was like 12.30 am. It was so good. They had a, like a, they had a sour and sweet sauce. And I was dunking my fried chicken in that. It kind of tasted like the sweet Korean fried chicken. Oh, it was so good. <clears throat> but I probably shouldn't have ate that late and that much. At least it was just chicken. I didn't even have a single fry. Just fried chicken. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> hey, they don't stink. Mm -hmm. My farts smell delicious, like fried chicken. <laughs> I'm kidding. I actually don't really smell anything, but mm, they do. They do be rippling though. They're making waves, that's for sure. Oh yeah, this key. Okay, in here. Both of them kind of fail because he slams the doors and the cyber truck completely just falls apart and the F-150 the windows break. Mm. But the doors still work. So I think the truck wins that one. Mm. They're breaking the the acceleration pedal. The cyber truck one broke almost within a minute, less than that, and he couldn't break the truck's pedal. Look, it's like made with plastic bits. What the fuck? <clears throat> I hope that this video helps improve the quality of the cyber trucks because this is way too much for a car that claims to almost be indestructible, you know, withstand a lot of damage. I mean, it's really cool that the body itself can withstand collision and a lot of damage, but if everything else in the truck sucks, then it's not a good product. It's, it's not a good vehicle. <clears throat> You're just buying like a bunker, like a safe. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh yeah, this is where they put the C4 explosives in there. His other cars are nice. I forgot which one I looked at. I, I really like that. Yeah, I like the other cars. The, the actual sedans. I think the Cybertruck was just way too overhyped. And... I mean, it was his fault too. Like, he gave us all these expectations. <clears throat> and... It just didn't measure up. But... It's good that... We see... Uh, we see... Someone actually try to test it to the extreme and <clears throat> fat check all the claims that Elon has been making. For the most part, it does seem- look, look at that. It took C4 explosive. When you see it compared to the truck, okay, that's really fucking cool. But, again, I think it's really shitty that you s you could take it apart by hand you might not be able to you know destroy it with c4 if it's hitting the doors or the body but you can just peel it apart and that's the part about it that kind of pisses me off everything else you see all of the frame the mirror it's just made out of fucking plastic. It's not uh, welded into the body. <laughs> oh, hey! <laughs> Jake Paul. <clears throat> Elon took a drawing of a car he skid drew and gave it to the engineer and said, Make this. <laughs> it does look like the type of cars that we all, <laughs> all like to draw. It was never going to be good. <clears throat> I mean... I had more expectations of it because of that. They kidnapped the door for what's that? <laughs> uh, they just wanted to show us how many people could fit in there. <clears throat> Apparently 11 and a half. <clears throat> They're going pretty hard. It's... See? It withstands a lot. <clears throat> but they're not even like, trying to take it apart right now. They're just mostly hitting the windows. Look, they're throwing weights at it! That's crazy! That's not even welded into the body. That's fucking super glued almost. Did you guys see how easily he just tore that apart? And you see it's not welded. It's like fucking glued. Look, he's trying to break the truck. The 150s. And now look how easy it is to just break this. He didn't even have to kick it. The way that the cyber truck is built is how I would repair or like restore a car. Because I can't fucking weld. I would just fucking crazy glue it. Okay, so after all of the, after all of those durability tests, 
The steering wheel of the car is, uh, is locked. The car is deemed unsafe to drive. And so, it's not going to let you drive it after that. Mm. So let's say, let's say you are in a real life scenario where your car takes a lot of damage. Imagine some stupid ass computer locking it for you and now you're trapped and you just can't go anywhere. You might as well just be fucking dead in like a real life emergency scenario. But even though the F-150 has holes on it, you could still drive it. The fact that this Cybertruck lost to a 150 Ford says that they still need so much to improve on. <clears throat> you want to start a project car? Yeah, I miss, especially because right now is the perfect time to do that. The weather is great. Except on the days that it gets super, super hot, but it's really nice to be outside and just like messing around with the cars. I still haven't, I still haven't settled on a new car that I want to buy. I keep telling myself that the more I save up, the better anyway. But I shouldn't wait until the last minute because my car is on its last legs. <laughs> last wheels, I mean. It's it's just asking to be put down. But every day I mm, grab the keys and make them drive anyway. Mm. I think my my car sees hates seeing me come. But yeah, this was a really cool video. <clears throat> you guys think Elon is gonna try to pay him off mm, or hate on him? Mm, I hope he's good about this feedback instead of just making some tweet or meme on twitter <laughs> and Kai is just a slime of a seal <laughs> it is it, it's been uh, it's been given me good service for a couple of years now and just when I think there's no more life in it it just it's like it hears me talk sometimes when my car is just like having a really shit week <laughs> I think to myself um damn I should really get a new car now this is probably a sign this is the time I should start looking for a car and then the next day my car is okay it's like all of the sudden all of the check engine lights are off it's driving smoothly and then it'll only last a couple of days and then it's back to shit again but I swear, the car just hears when I start plotting to replace it. And it says, never mind, I'm still working. I'm here, I got a couple more miles in me left. <laughs> we can go for a drive. <laughs> and I just keep driving it, so... I should really, you know, let it rest in peace before winter this year, because... Winter is the worst for it. I don't think it's going to survive the winter, actually. <laughs> Hi, Nasu. Good morning. Or afternoon. <laughs> Hi, 
Hi, hi. Um, we're just jumping off and having some morning tea. I recently got a Keurig machine, and now it, I'm gonna. It's going to enable me to be even more lazy because I can just use the machine to heat up water and make tea <laughs> instead of going downstairs so much. So annoying. Tea bag. <clears throat> Get tea bag, chat. <laughs> this is my second cup, and actually, just talking about it and hearing all of that water. Makes me want to go pee. <laughs> um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go piss. Stop. <clears throat> I'll be right back. Done. You guys want to do alerts? It's been a while since we played this actually. <laughs> I'm not very good at it. That's why we don't play it. <laughs> because. I suck at it. <clears throat> but hey, I'm gonna leave it up in case you guys wanna play. I'll be right back. Uncle Pete. Um.
total and I can't pass up a good I can't pass up a, a good puppy <laughs> mm, any chance to duke it out gotta take a in I'm still super gassy by the way <laughs> I feel like Terrence and Howard I saw their names why what are <laughs> the South Park characters <laughs> well <laughs> why hi good morning <laughs> Dun, dun, dun. <clears throat> Welcome. Hi, hi, willing to sleep. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Sorry, I'm covering. <laughs> I'm gonna pack a hit. That's what I was gonna do. Also, uh, I didn't notice that I've been streaming for over two hours. They just kind of flew by. <laughs> well, <clears throat> I meant to do some or other uh, morning routine uh, related things, but uh, I kind of got a bit carried away yapping my bad chat. <laughs> uh, I am Neil here. Yeah, okay, sure you are. <clears throat> And I'm not horny. Don't look at the horns. Not there. <laughs> mm. Mm. up earlier also work on my afternoon schedule um, because there's a couple of things that I want to play I want to play the trust to impress <laughs> stupid game and I also want to play super super seducer um, what else I had a list, but I'm forgetting. <laughs> I I do I just wanna play some games and I wanna pick a time in the afternoon that we can do that. Whether it's on stream by the duck house. I wanna I wanna set more time aside for that. Mm. So, let's take a last hit. Bum bum. Bum. Rough. Oi. Bum. Me. Wait, does that not work? How about this? Oh, I see. <laughs> well, mm, it says here on our contract that you can't leave. I signed no thing. When did I sign something? <clears throat> Actually, you guys signed a contract with me. That says that you're supposed to say and do whatever I ask of you. <clears throat> like a good duck sitter should. <laughs> um. Okay. 
I don't know. I don't even know if that's a real word. I think I just made up a word. <laughs> that one was hard. It was so hard. I don't. I only. I could only think of cat. <laughs> you know, maybe I just did really bad in that round because I didn't have my thinking weight. That's it, right guys? <laughs> uh, I'll let her restart while I pack this hit. I, I'll participate in the next round. I'll do much better, I'm sure. <laughs> and especially since I'll have my thinking weed. <laughs> okay, okay, after this round, I'm going to mentally start preparing to say goodbye to chat and the sitters. <laughs> I don't wanna... I don't wanna be a, a dog woman. Dog woman boss. I just wanna be dog. Um... Sit. 
three words though. Dang, what the heck? I can think of it. Be right now, so spill the milk scene with Patrick. <laughs> Please. I did so bad in that round, too. Why are these so hard? Okay, okay. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna hesitate anymore. Come here, Jack. Mm -hmm. Come here, come here. Mm. Do you want some of my thinking weed? Mm. It'll help you with the game. <laughs> Open up. But it's right there. It's like an actual word. It spelled the word this time. <laughs> oh, gotcha. First hit of the day. Yay! <clears throat> I still have a smoky heel. Command shouldn't work anymore. It's a redeem now. I wanted to make it more lazy. <clears throat> so I think it'll be faster than just typing it. <laughs> that one was a hard one. Wait, okay, one last one for reals this time. <clears throat> okay, glow. Glow. Um mm, Eclo. Oh wait, there's no two O's. Uh, now it's three words. You need four or more. Mm -mm. Long. Long, long, long. <clears throat> um, loin. Loin. It's literally right there. <clears throat> um, um, what about gnome? No, wait, no M. Ah. Uh, goon! Wait, no, no O. What? Gong? Oh, yeah, I forgot. That's, that's an instrument, right? Is it? Wing! Oh, wing, 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 wait. Oh, Ty already said that. <laughs> My bad. <clears throat> um. Lion. <gasps> Good one. Um. Um. Oh, what if 
about login? Like computer login? Effort, actually, <laughs> good job. I'm proud of you, chat. <laughs> that was fun. I'm glad we could end on a good round. <laughs> I think uh, this this is a sign that I should call it. I'm like, no. <laughs> I just don't want to sleep. I am so clingy. Um, um, one last hit chat. Is that just an excuse for me to smoke more? <laughs> oh well, who cares? One last chat. Mm. One last hit. Hi Astray, good morning. Happy Monday. You came at a mm. good and bad time because we're leaving. But that's not before we take a nice hit of this. That I'm gonna pack. <laughs> it wasn't a good no before the game. Before the game. Oh, okay. I see what you're trying to do. I see what you're trying to say. <clears throat> Don't diss my words. That's not what I said. Why you? Why you womaning in my chat? Only I'm allowed to do that. <laughs> Only I'm allowed to gaslight you guys like that. Yes, it is part of the three pinnacles of women, which is girl boss, gatekeep, gatekeep and gaslighting. <laughs> Mm-hmm. 
Never mind. It's quite literally hell outside right now. I don't think I'm going fishing. <laughs> oh, it's so sad. But it's okay. At least we spend some time together. Maybe I can convince them anyway. Or to go a little bit later than usual. Because it is almost 90 degrees outside. <laughs> <laughs> Why is it so hot? It does not feel like that in here. <laughs> it's a good thing we fell asleep with the AC on. <clears throat> I can't believe how hot it is outside. What the fuck? <clears throat> Man. Oh, also, okay, before we end. No, 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 right. I'm sorry. <laughs> it, it, it was gonna cut me off. Um, yesterday, I thought that the latest House of Dragon episode was going to be the one, like, the semi final. But it was actually the final episode. Oh, that should hurt. That shit hurt it. It hurt it. I I can't believe the season is over and I have to wait two years. <laughs> what am I gonna do to fill the void? <laughs> I mean besides drown myself in other shows. It's fully done, second season is wrapped up. I I can't believe <laughs> Yeah, I guess I could do you, Cha. Parallax. Tell thank you, Hello Fama. Welcome. I can't believe it. Can you guys watch with me now? You guys can watch with me, right? You want to watch with me. Totally. Um I I was so excited. Now I'm so sad. Um I wanna start watching Game of Thrones again. To kind like Cause I forgot about a lot of the stuff that happened there And now that I finished House of Dragon, I think it would be a good time to <clears throat> refresh like <clears throat> But um, maybe we can do both on it To see what people wanna start House of Dragon or Game of Thrones first <clears throat> I don't know, I just really wanna jab about it and I can't believe that it's over, over. It ended in such a cliffhanger. I can't believe we have to wait so long. Oh. I've never seen it. Yay! I love being you guys this first. I... Uh, yeah, I... Another series that I would also like to go back and rewatch is probably, uh... The C Nation one, cause it's so funny. And there's like, I like, I like comedy gore media, so like, the Chucky series I think is really good because it's goofy, it doesn't take itself too seriously, and it's really bloody in some scenes. <clears throat> I love Evil Dead because of the same reason, 
they have really funny scenes with like overly gory and bloody moments and I think they uh, the way that they execute them is really nice <clears throat> but um I forgot where I was going with this oh right Sea Nation yeah Sea <laughs> Nation is definitely one of those shows as well <clears throat> and I I wanna put more people onto it because I don't think a lot of people know about it. Every time that I talk about it, everyone's like, huh? What the fuck are you talking about? And I think it's one of the best zombie shows there is. Even if it is fucking goofy. <laughs> I think that's the charm to it, actually. <clears throat> that it is goofy. Um. <clears throat> but, um, um, well, <laughs> well, Suka, Suka Shima, thank you for the follow. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, I hate saying goodbye. <clears throat> nope. <laughs> oh, <clears throat> that works. <clears throat> I want to play it. There's this other game that I want to play too. I had so much to jump about. <laughs> but I'm gonna shut up and get this hair ready. <clears throat> because <clears throat> I should be good and start my day. Time to go from puppy girl to Dog woman. <coughs> There's so many games coming in October. What are you excited about? <coughs> I don't think there's a game that I'm really anticipating on its release, now that I think about it. You guys hear that? That's the garbage truck. <coughs> Our pants getting cleaned out. <laughs> Are you gonna give up? Oh my god, I just... <clears throat> I just need to go actually eat breakfast and start my day. That's the problem. <laughs> Cause it's all, it's almost, almost one o'clock here. And I've only had three cups of tea. <clears throat> Lots of water. <coughs> and weed. <laughs> so, <coughs> I should be good and no, actually get something to eat. <coughs> and check in. <coughs> um, on the people I made plans with, they'll go fishing. Hi, we don't know where to go. Mm. I think I woke up kind of late. <laughs> you hold it close to Patty's birthday. <clears throat> it feels like such a nice day. Uh, can it be the end of the week already? I just want to curl up and you up and sleep. That sounds so good. Just thinking about it got me wanting to go back to bed. But I won't. I won't. I have to eat. <laughs> Even though the bed sounds really nice right now. 
Uh, my own doing ASMR makes me sleepy myself sometimes because it's so nice and I vibe here and I'm also using the <coughs> the direct settings on the <sighs> on the on the sound machine sound box. I don't even know how you call this. I'm such an audio nerd. Mm. But um, I basically have the the audio audio monitoring on, so I can hear how the triggers sound in real time. And a lot of time, especially if I like a certain trigger, it's so nice. And my own ASMR makes me comfortable enough to when I go back to bed and take a nap. <laughs> but I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna smoke and mm, go downstairs and get something good for me to eat. Um, okay. <laughs> I'm really on this stream this time. <clears throat> Cheers, guys. Um, So much fun. <laughs> um, no. Okay, here's the last hit. Bye Hold on, hold on, I got my... next time oh and if you're from youtube sorry about the no button video yesterday hopefully youtube won't remove this one because i did talk about wwe and ufc for a bit but i didn't show any clips <laughs> whoops 